All right, so we're here at Bleak Falls Barrow. The uh, the last journal piece is somewhere in here, so... Oh, yep, nope. Stuck prices, I don't really care. I'm not doing this for a... Uh, I'm not trying to trade a whole lot of stuff, so it doesn't really matter. Got bandit schemers. Oh, my frame rate's dropping a little bit. Oh, or a lot, all right. So, uh, <laughs> this is the first time I've played a game that isn't GTA V on PC since... GTA 5 came out on PC earlier this week, and uh, kudos to Rockstar, by the way, for releasing that um, a few hours early, because they, re they released it at 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time rather than at midnight, which a lot of people expected. And uh, the thing is, the kind of funny thing is that I've had uh, GTA 5 on 360 since it came out, you know, like a year and a half ago, and despite that, I was more than happy. Did I really just hit... I hit the pot, not one of them. Huh. Uh, despite the fact that I've had it for a year and a half, you know, since the game launched originally, I was more than happy to drop another $60 on it, and I could not be happier with that game. It's super, it's just fantastic, really well optimized, and um, incredible. I don't even care about the delays or anything like that, because it just turned out so well, and I couldn't have uh, asked for Rockstar to do a better job. And um, some of the things that are exclusive to PC are really cool, like the... Uh, the editor, and um, the director mode. I mainly just use the editor without using the director mode at all because for the director mode, you get access to more vehicles and such uh, if you're further in the story because um, you use the uh, the main story uh, character's cars. And I just started the story. I've mainly been playing online because of the fact that I'm doing videos, and we've recorded so many videos. Let me tell you how many videos we've recorded. Uh, as it is, I almost forgot to record Skyrim for uh, for this week. Uh, this Skyrim, the Skyrim mod Saturday review extravaganza. Best series ever, longest name for a series ever. Just because I've been playing so much GTA for fun, uh, setting up other videos that we're going to do, planning stuff out with... Uh, Al and Matt, and then uh, we're still trying to find a fourth. I just fell through that like an idiot. Oh well, doesn't even matter. Uh, yeah, we're still trying to find a fourth person for uh, some stuff, but I we have a couple people in mind, so it shouldn't be a huge issue. All right, so I guess it's right in this room. I mean, it sure looks like it would be. It's either in this room or the next room. Oh hey, Mr. Spider. Yep, everything just resets after a while. Is it in this egg sack? No, uh, I think it's in the next room because I don't know where it would be in here. Um, I don't know if this quest implements radiant uh, locations or if it was for specific locations. I'm honestly not sure. Um, I didn't really look that up on the mod page because I didn't want to spoil too much for myself in terms of this mod. Where the hell is it, though? Is it... Is it below us? Let me check the map real quick. Oh, yeah, it's all the way on the other side of the, uh... Of the barrow, so never mind. Thought it was in that room. It looks really close, is the thing. So, oh well. Uh, also, I was, um... The last time I recorded for this mod was also, like, I want to say two weeks ago, and I've just been putting it off because... I was focusing a lot more on recording the modded playthrough, because I, I personally prefer that to the Skyrim Saturday mods. Uh, to me, it's just more fun because it's an ongoing uh, singular series, as opposed to this where I have to change uh, what mod it is. You know, every... I was going to say every week, but it's not every week. It's every time I finish a mod. Well, hello, Mr. Draugr. How you doing? Oh. Oh, hey. Alright. Um, I've seen a couple comments asking if I'll ever do a playthrough of Elder Scrolls Online. I'm just gonna say right now, the answer is no, I will never do a playthrough of it. One, because it's an MMO, and doing a playthrough would last a thousand parts, and I am... Yeah, no. A thousand part series sounds horrible. And, and granted, a thousand part series, I don't think anyone will watch it either. Alright. Someone else is down there. Uh, and I also wouldn't do it just because that's a game 
that I play just for fun. So if I ever did videos in it, it wouldn't be a series. It might be a couple one-off videos where... Because um, right now they're doing a beta for the... Well, they're not doing it yet. They're going to do the beta for the uh, console version soon. So that's something I would even be tempted to do a video for. Just... Um, I like how this is just resting on top of the... On top of the chest. Uh, it's probably just easier if I just walk back to the entrance, honestly. So, uh, I would probably just do a video where I maybe showed off, like, the console version and talk about how it feels using a controller versus the keyboard, which I'm familiar with, uh, for the PC version, stuff like that. Um, I wouldn't do a graphics comparison video because I'm not about that. That's not my kind of thing. I'm not, I'm not a huge fan of graphics comparison videos. It always feels like it's just a way of starting fights in the comments or, like, bringing people in or like it pulls people in just so that they can argue with one another that's the vibe i always got from a lot of graphics comparisons personally um but i would just discuss it like oh yeah the draw distance is better on um pc for example or oh the uh frame rate is limited to 30 on consoles stuff like that pretty basic stuff but we'll see i don't even know if i'm in the beta for the consoles. I got an email about it, but I'll have to double check that because I really didn't follow up on it. But I'd be happy to do a video just discussing that briefly. And then I'd also be happy to do maybe, say, a few one-off videos in Elder Scrolls Online on PC just talking about new patches or updates, stuff like that, if anyone was interested in that. I don't know how large of a Elder Scrolls Online audience I would have necessarily. Uh, although, granted, I assume there is some crossover between that and Skyrim. But, you know, you, just let me know in the comments. I'm always very receptive to um, viewer feedback, opinions, suggestions, all of that. I do read every comment, just so you guys know. So, if there is anything that you guys ever want to see, um, even if I don't respond to a comment or necessarily make what you guys ask for, I do read it and I do take everything into account. But also, keep in mind that I am just one person. One person who is still in college, for that matter, too. There is an update for this mod, so hopefully it'll fix with some help with um, fixing some of the weird crashes I had earlier. But yeah, like I said, I am just one person, and it is really dark in here. Uh, I am just one person, so it does limit my availability to do every video that people suggest that I do. Oh, here's Miss Master Ithu Allen. I am a wizard lord, oh. not a common doll mage. Oh, insult the mages, why don't you? Here are the journal pieces, dickbag. Good. Good. Oh, don't stand there expecting to be praised. Yeah, I don't know why I expected it at all. A task that anyone here could have. Then why didn't you send them? But I will still give you compensation, because everyone in Skyrim is as greedy as the snow is cold. I wonder if the last mission is to kill that him. That insufferable Ortma has been ranting and raving about some loan. He had the audacity to accuse me of stealing his money. Let me guess, he stole the money. I suggest you go calm him down before I'm forced to put him down. Is that, is that how this, is that how this guild works? Do, are you able to just kill people because you feel like it? Just because you don't like them? You are rather oh. hard to track down. Oh. I'll give uh, you that. All right, this is. All right, never mind that. Go away, sir. We're not here for you. <laughs> We're not here for you. No, 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 no. Oh, fine, damn it. You were rather hard to track All right, fine. Um, this is from Worm's Tooth. I forgot to disable and the Worm's Tooth in my... Ah, hard to track fuck you. Down. Go you away, buddy. Back. Go away. How you doing? I once have been Laurelton's apprentice, but that doesn't mean I couldn't beat him in a battle. So what's wrong, buddy? Someone has stolen my loan from Turlin. Oh. Can't trust anyone around here. I need that gold. I need them. Listen, you've always been pretty reliable. Help me oh. find out who stole my coin. Hello, ma'am. Question everyone here. And trust no one. Trust no one, you, you say? find out who stole it, and I'll give you some of the gold. Trust no one? That means you stole the gold. Also, I like this because we'll this seems again. to be different from... The other types of quests, because so far everything's been pretty just mess, sort mess, of fetch mess, quests. Mess, 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 mess. Why do I have to clean up their mess? Uh, I left my sword so 
Oh, okay. Uh, I have some questions oh, for you. What do you need? Uh, do you know anything about some gold being stolen? Um, let me see. Don't know why I started with you. You're an idiot. Mm. I feel a sneeze coming on. Mm. <gasps> oh, sorry. Mm. Well... I'm guessing you don't. No. Sorry. Yeah, alright. Thank you for wasting my time, ma'am. Ugh. Oh, alright, how about you? Hello. I got some questions. Need something. Yeah, I got some questions. For you, specifically. What do you need? Oh, I'll ask Rose. Do you know anything about some stolen... Uh, about some gold being stolen? Nah. I don't do this job for the gold. Uh-huh. I just like smashing in a few heads once in a while. Alright. Uh... That's a Good luck pretty fair there. answer. How you doing? It's very nice in the center, isn't it? I have some questions for you. What do you need? Do you know anything about some gold being stolen? Well, I uh, know it wasn't me. Oh. I suggest asking Lado. I hear he knows a bit about stealth. Oh. Not that I'm accusing him. It just fits. Lardo, you say? We'll speak soon, I like this. Laralton keeps complaining about the mess. If he hates mess, why is he the cleaner? Well, not everyone gets to choose their job, all right? What do you need? Someone has accused you of stealing Alarin's money. And this is why I don't bother talking to anyone around here. Oh, is that so? I didn't steal the stupid gold. I don't care about septums. Uh-huh. Personally... I think it was Laralton. But I love his voice. He hates us all for making him clean floors. Oh. You should talk to him. All right. Got to follow the okay. leads now. Hey, so Laralton. Soon. Listen, I hope you didn't steal the money with I friends. I was the best in this damn guild. Now they think I'm too old and feeble. Oh, no. He stole it, didn't he? What do you need? You Did you steal it? Please tell me you didn't. These young halfwits don't know what they're talking about. Good, glad to hear it. Absolutely disrespectful. Then who was it? That Martellan lady looks extremely shifty. Oh. I bet she's waiting for a chance to get a bit of gold so she can retire and go to Hammerfell. And now you learn what everyone in the guild thinks about each other. <laughs> everyone just hates storm. each other. <laughs> and if you do, don't mess uh, up my floor. Who this was it? Be important. That I'm supposed to question? Not Maris. Martellin? Yes, my dear. Uh, I have some questions for you. What do you need? Someone has accused you of stealing Alarin's money. Well, I would never. She is the master. I don't want to accuse her, though. Actually, I saw Alarin leave it in the little cellar in the leader's quarters. Oh. The poor dear probably misplaced it. <sighs> All right. Go tell him that's where it is to put his mind at rest. Thank you, Master Martell, and thank you very much. Also, for that matter, mess, mess, what mess, gives mess, mess. with um? Why do I have to clean up with, their mess? With Laralton, where'd he go? With with Laralton accusing the master. I mean, granted, he doesn't really like a whole lot of people here because they make him oh, clean, but still, are you going to speak? Show some respect for your or boss. Irritate me all day. Hey, you asked for a favor. Martellan said your gold is in the cellar. I... Oh, yes. Yep. My mistake. Don't we both look, idiot, now? Well... Thank you for your assistance. It turns yes. out everyone in this guild hates each other. Now, don't tell anyone about this. Let's forget it ever happened. Okay, that I can do. I'm, I'm so embarrassed. Yep, you shouldn't be, buddy. All right. We'll speak again. Uh... Do you have anything you want to... Oh. oh, hello there. Oh, no, Mr. Mr. Ithu Allen wants to talk to me again. The Telvani wizards are nothing compared to me. All right, yep. You have a task for me? You know I always have tasks for you. Yep, and I'm not happy about that. I need somebody executed, and I'm too busy to do it myself. Is this a thing for the a guild? A court member of the Jarl in Dawnstar wants to try and close down the Distin Sanctuary in Skyrim. The Distin really aren't we that noble. The assassination task is due, don't you think? I, I really don't know anything about the, the Distin when you think about Dawnstar it. The White is their location. Return immediately once you've finished. I really don't know that much about the Distin, I just know that... That's Master Ithy... <laughs> Master Thew Allen's kind of a dick, and that apparently no one in the guild likes each other. That the Ebony Warriors wanted to kill them. And I get sent on some really weird 
pretty illegal missions, let me tell you. Alright, I'm gonna save immediately because otherwise my game might crash again. Also, I noticed that whenever I'm leaving the sanctuary, my EMB just seems to kind of like stop working altogether. I don't know why. Uh, whoops, didn't type that incorrectly. Much better. Granted, yes, that also resets the weather, but still, it just also helps reset the ENB as well, just in terms of weather. All right. So I'm going to the White Hall. Yeah, I am. Oh, enemies nearby. Yeah, all right. Hopefully the game doesn't crash. Don't crash, game. I hope that patch worked. Uh, there's a few new quest mods out, or at least there's one new quest mod out, but I have to kind of figure out if I want to do that or do something else first. I've heard that the... Um, so there's this one mod that came out recently called the uh, the Grey Cow of Nocturnal, and it's a DLC-sized quest mod, and apparently it's like 10 hours long, uh, and has new areas and new quests and voice acting and everything and all that good stuff, but I've also been told, and I've heard that, um, oh god, my game almost crashed. I think one's enough. No, I agree, one is definitely enough. It's a bit overkill. But, um, oh, I guess I'm killing you. I like that I don't have any choice in this. It's like, hey, here's some woman. Just murder her. I don't know. I, w I do wish there was more depth to the story. Actually, can I just... Um... Silly? Try stupid. I need you to do something. Well, sure, what can I do for you? I'm a rose. Uh, can I not have her... I can't have her attack? Oh well. Ma'am, I apologize. Oh, don't set anything on fire, huh? I feel bad now. I feel... Oh! <sighs> Fine, alright. Yeah, I kind of deserve it. I mean, I killed someone, I'm paying 40 gold, it's kind of a bargain when you think about it. I do feel bad, like, yes, there wasn't a whole lot of... I, I didn't know anything about this woman, but still, just... Well, let's face it, Mr. Master at If You Allen's really just an asshole, and I just had to kill someone that I had no issue with. It. Oh, man, I feel bad. I do wish I had more choice in this mod, because... I wish there was a choice not to kill her, and if I could, like... I mean, this is going to be kind of elaborate. If I could help her, like, fake her death and help her disappear or something like that, that'd be pretty sweet. Um, but as I was saying about that other mod, the uh, Grey Cal of Nocturnal, uh, I've also heard that it's more thief and puzzle based, and this is me we're talking about. That would not go well at all. I could have been in the Morrowind Sanctuary. Uh huh. But instead, I must face the cold of Skyrim. How pleasant. Listen, I could have dealt with any other master of the distant, but instead, I have to deal with you. How unpleasant. That's no sarcasm for you, buddy. No sarcasm. Your ability to mindlessly murder people without a second thought is a pleasing trait. I dislike this guy so much. Come back to me for a new task. Don't take too long. What do you mean, come back to you? I'm right here. Just tell me already. I need this letter delivered to our friendly White Run Court member. Okay. If I were him, I'd be fairly concerned about how much the distant requires his help as of recently. But I digress. Alright. Deliver this letter and return to me. Like I said, it's a lot of fetch quests or just go here, do this, come back. Sometimes I gotta kill people, sometimes I don't. Um, which is fine and all, but it is kind of repetitive. I can see how this might make more sense alongside a full playthrough of a game, not just powering through it in, you know, essentially one sitting or two. That being said, it's just kind of, I don't know, because the mod is, um, sort of advertised as coming with 20 quests, which is great and all, but there are 20 quests of just really repetitive stuff, and there's not a whole lot of variation or anything like that, so in that sense, it's just... Like, it's not a bad mod, it really isn't, but I could definitely have gone for less quests and more depth in those fewer 
quests. I don't know, that's just my personal preference slash um, general idea about this mod. 